way. It's like something. Looks like that tall skinny dude from Road Trip. Oh, the same guy who plays in like the new guy as well. Look at how pretty this game is. You feel like you're in it, man. It's crazy. Like I can feel the wind. So, for anyone who doesn't know, the female is faster because for some reason when I come out of the elevator after this transition, I can gain control of my character right away. And that's a feature that, like, look, right away, I just get to move. When you're the male, the game walks you out of the elevator on your own, like on its own, and you don't have control yet. It's, it makes no sense, but that's one of the features that makes the girl faster in this game. Which I think is very strange. Oh, did we change my game title and stuff? I forgot to. They probably designed the game with a male character. That's kind of what Chad was saying, but I was like, there's no way that they didn't test the female. That's like impossible because they, they would have had to beat the game and test with both characters, right? So my theory, here's my theory. My theory is that they had a select people beat the game or test the game with the male character and the female character and those people didn't interact with each other and they also didn't play with the other so they had some people test with the female and walked out of the elevator but they didn't know any better because they didn't beat it with the male that's that's my guess right some people tested male some people tested female but nobody tested both of them I can see that. Thank you for your cooperation. What is the story behind this game? I don't know what the evil presence in this game, but technically the way this game is, it's a it's a prequel to Remnant, and it has something to do with people's dreams. That's all I kind of... I'm not overly familiar with the lore, but I know it's... I don't know. I like it. I like the vibes that this game brings. I love the vibes. Nice little gold for me there. There's swords, magic, and tech. Though There's not much magic. Uh, I guess a little bit. Whatever that tree does to me, I guess that's considered magic, right? I so I still stream at nights, but I also stream in the mornings now too. Oh, uh, almost. So that's kind of bad RNG. Almost got out of that. I think this guy chasing me is good RNG. Yeah. Nice. Nice. Oh, get out of my way, you fuck. I gotta kill him. He's definitely. Oh, oh my god, I almost soft locked. There we go. Oh, so close. Why didn't I land on the ledge? Lose a bit of time there. Not, not the end of the world. But I still did the ladder skip. You 
doing your mating call, buddy? Ah, they all just jump around making sounds and screaming. Yep. Yep. Okay, just don't get stuck on the lantern. Yeah, dude, I've been stuck on that lantern like six times. Nice, I get another ladder skip right here as long as this guy's not in my way. Okay, he's not. Nice. Whoop. What game is this? This is Kronos Before the Ashes. Alright, so we're gonna lose a bit of time on Great Tree, I think, because I I killed that little dude, which I think is I think it's a good idea, you know what I mean, to start killing some of the enemies that, you know, I'm not at the point where it's like, oh, great RNG or reset, you know, but we're still on pace for like pretty decent speed runs. And this game is very fun. I really like this game. It's cheap sometimes and it's got bad things, but when you're a speedrunner, you'll literally say anything to feel better about what's going on when things aren't going your way. That's like the gamer trait. Right? That's, that's, that's essentially what gamers do. If I wasn't playing this game, I'd be so rich right now, but I'm wasting my time on this yeah. shitty game. Like, why, you know? Gamers will say anything to feel better about losing. Including myself, I'm no exception. Everything is RNG. Most shit is RNG. Heal. How much of the world record time is dependent on RNG in this? Right now, not a lot. I mean, pure skill could save me time on like every split probably as I get better. Just little bits of RNG here and there. Like, is this guy gonna roll or not roll? So he didn't roll. So now I don't have to dive like that. So I saved a bit of time there, right? So like stuff like that's RNG always gonna be. Most stuff is not actually RNG. I think. I'm not how, I don't know how well knowledge you are with the games that you're watching to know whether something's RNG or not. I want to make sure you know. Nice little level up there. Level up like agility and stuff. Make sure he's out of there. Yes. Good. Yeah, it's still technically RNG. Like, like a great example is the Mario Mario Brothers three, the Hammer Brothers. They're they're dependent on what frame you end the level. But if you powered on the console and played every single thing with the exact same amount of lag frames and everything was all the same, you'd get the exact same pattern. Technically not RNG, but because we're not perfect, it there's no other way to describe it other than random. It will it will always only ever be random because there's no way you'll ever do anything perfect. And I didn't forget the door. 
I think Twitch still thinks I'm playing on Mario 3. Well, I asked mods if they could change the game and stuff. Has, has that changed at all? I forgot to. Move, bud. Nice try, buddy. You guys like my new Mario 3 ROM hack? Nice try, buddy. all the ROM hack. Made it back on shit. That was close. Nice, I got it though. I got the ledge skip, yeah. That was sick. I have a Kronos command. I mean you can make a Kronos command, sure. I just Yeah, yeah. yeah. Come on, hit me, hit me, hit me. Uh, I need to take a little bit of damage here. But I don't want to stop for it, obviously. Okay, they're not gonna hit me? That's fine. You love this little guy? Dude, I love this game. This game's great. Zoom to the door? Yeah. Get the zoomies. Yo, take it easy, dude. Take it easy. Nice. Oh, 0.69, Pog. It's okay, Kerbo. Take that menu nice and slow. Yo, Chris and Graham, thank you very much. Yo, welcome back, dude. 62 months. Jesus. That's a long time. Yeah, you probably did, man. Twitch doesn't know what's going on. I just... When Twitch makes me resubscribe to a channel, like, twice in, like, two weeks, I always go and check my bank account. Like, I don't know if something weird's going on, you know? Like, what the fuck? Oh, yeah, that's a big boy right there. Look at him. Very nice. Take death warp so I don't have to run back. That's that's really good. Yeah, yeah, both of my deaths were intentional there. Okay. Very bad.
Very nice. Oh my god, this is so fucking bad, man. Why are you targeted on that one? Exactly how I wanted that to go. I practice and I've calmed myself during the game. So you gotta destroy these three things, right? So I just destroyed that one. This game should have been another like 15 hours, man. Seven, like 10 more bosses. You know what I mean? Oh, would have been so great. weapons to use? Not really, no. This game's fantastic. I love this game. Sorry I'm not more explaining everything. I'm, I'm kind of focusing because my runs haven't been amazing lately and I've been practicing so I just want to make sure that I don't waste my practice by not focusing kind of thing. But I, d I will look up and answer any questions you guys have any second that I get. So make sure you put them in the chat and I'll definitely... Much better than last time. Exactly, I have to focus much more on video games other than Mario 3 when I play. No, this game came out for a month ago.
Okay, so we're gonna go for a golem skip. Skip this boss. They implemented a mechanic where if you try and climb the ladder and leave the boss battle, he, pound, he ground pounds the ground, but if you roll out of it, and then go up quick, he doesn't notice. Very beautiful. Skips the boss. Boss skip. Very nice. Very nice. It's scary, but it works. I like it. Oh, he hit the minion instead of me. Very nice. I got a little bit of decent RNG here. Oh, I just squeaked by. Get a slice in on this guy in the mirror, it's really nice. That health bar goes away now, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> That's what's awesome about this game. Like, the glitches like that is so silly. Oh, I get- Oh, I leveled up. I get full health, so I don't have to use my health. So I want to get, like, a ledge slide here where it causes me to not take damage, but I fall to the bottom. Uh, it didn't work. It's like you hit the second level, but it, you don't stand on it, like pushes you off. Ooh, I thought he was gonna get me. Damn, I definitely could have pressed that a little bit faster. His like opening swing there will hit you. That's like his battle cry or whatever, but it still hits you. Very strange. Really nice if he didn't follow me. He is one intense dude. He's still coming. Are the devs aware of these things? I'm in the Discord and I let them know like how things are going. I told them about golem skips, boss glitches, like things that uh, me and my buddy have found because there's no other, no no one else doing this. So all these little glitches are found by us and yeah, they're really cool. The aggro range is crazy. I know, dude. They just follow you. That's it. There's no way out. Mm. 
There is no way out. healing here just in case man i might get stuck in this door i might die here it's very possible very very possible so i wasted my heal but i i'm so happy that's one of the hardest doorways there he's still on me it, this is the dude that was from, like, the sparkly tree area with, like, the wooden platforms and stuff. He literally followed me into the temple. So, what's interesting about that is that there's another enemy that follows me so hard, okay? That, you see how my arm is lit up? That's called the arcane. That boosts my speed and attack and all that stuff. I've been saving it for, like, five minutes and I'm gonna continue saving this arcane to run faster than an enemy so that I can... That I can enter a boss battle without the enemy coming into the boss battle with me. I've been working so hard on out-of-bounds stuff. And then the run sucks. I know. Well, I've been trying to find lots of different things, but... So far, we're only... Oh, I got me. So yeah, my arm has been lit up for a long time, and I save it for one specific thing, and that's to get away from this big guy who just... If he comes in the boss battle, like, it sucks. Okay. Nice. Very nice. Take a sip of my flat Red Bull. Very nice, very nice. Good stuff. The, me the, the menuing also doesn't have up rotates. Which means when I press... When I have a list of items, if I press up, I won't go to the bottom of the list and work my way up. What? I hit my head? So those were just puzzles that I've already answered before, so it's nothing... <laughs> He's friendly until you mess up the puzzle, and then he starts to fight you. And he's got so much health, too. It's crazy. It, it's really crazy how much health he has. Yeah, I knew that was coming. I think my Stam can get me to the statue here. No. This will. So I'm, so I'm finally about to use my arcane to allow me to surpass. Oh, come on, the stair. The, I like stood on a rock. You're gonna buy this game? It's great, it's a great game. I was, honestly, the, the way I stumbled on this game is I was like Jones and so hard for a Souls-like game, like an adventure, like difficult exploration and stuff and this one came up I was, I was i was searching and it was new it was only like a week old so this big guy is the guy that i'm gonna arcane my way out of this guy he will never leave me alone ever so essentially what i do is i go to the crystal here So I used my speed boost there, right? So I could run faster than him, 
Because if I didn't use my speed boost, he would join this battle. That big guy. He would follow me in here, and that would suck. Uh, I'm stuck. That would suck a lot. And this boss has a very bad time. I might be able to recharge my arcane for this boss battle and get a very, very fast uh, fourth cycle, but it all, the, it, it's not looking like I'm gonna do this. Yeah, it's not looking like that. So much menuing here. So I got my arcane back and I'm gonna use it on Pan. This guy always hits you, but apparently I got good RNG here. Oh, he almost hit me. You see, his poles weren't even close to the wall, but it activated the wall. Nice try, buddy, with the lasers. <laughs> All fighting and exploring. Yep. You gather some stuff and there are some puzzles, but... Uh, and you can level up your weapons too, but there's not a crazy amount of weapons. You can get a pole, like a staff, you can get a sword, you can get an axe, you can get a big hammer. I used the hammer my first playthrough, because it just dealt so much damage. Um, you can get a, a newer green sword, and like, that's it. Like, I was surprised at how small amount of weapons there are. But regardless, it's awesome. So please don't stop lock here. I soft locked. I don't know why. There's like that soft lock. There's a little time loss. Nice, good. That was great, Stam, right there. That's great, Stam. This guy didn't follow me. I'm not holding a lantern. I was already talking about it. It's the, my arcane. You'll figure it out. You'll see. It's okay. Oh, what? 
Oops, I forgot to split. That's okay. Oh, he still hit me. Nice, good RNG. Yes, thank you. Imagine he could like knock me off that. Boy, would that ever suck. Oh, I got stuck on a crystal. That's okay, though. That still got me. <laughs> that still got me. My fingers just switched with but which button for some reason, because I was mashing and it just canceled that. So that's a little, little bit of a time loss there. Honestly, my advice that I would give to anyone who plays Souls likes games is patience. Like, I, I might act like I'll, I'll freak out and get super mad when bad things happen or go or, or not go my way, but I still have patience to keep playing the game until I beat it, which is what most people want, I guess. Just take it easy, and when you get stuck, it just, of course, it's gonna take time. Of course, you're gonna struggle, right? Alright, so I really hope that these guys are not in my way. I'm almost at a level up, though, so I'll level up killing one of them, which is pretty good. Hopefully he's not right there. Nice. I thought I activated this. I didn't die. Wasn't much of a time loss there, but it was a heal. And I leveled up, so I'm gonna be a little bit stronger.
can't spin and have an object in Mario Maker 2, no. But they found like little tricks around that. I don't know why I was rolling forward but facing backwards there, but whatever, I guess. I was sick though. Got it. I lo I really like that boss pen. Why is he a bread guardian? <laughs> Very nice music in this game. This game appeals, I think, to every kind of different gamer, right? Like, it's beautiful, great gameplay, nice enemies, good design, good music, right? Just something for everyone, I feel. There's nothing on this on on speed demos or not speed demos speedruns.com. Oh my god, I almost missed it there. God, because I pressed start before I actually activated the A press.
Look, I'm stuck in the doorway. Wow. This is incredible. God, that... <sighs> I had no control of my character. The enemies are allowed to hit you while you're doing animations like that. Nothing I could have done. That's something that really bothers me about this game. I strategically tried to avoid them, you know what I mean? Draw them away from the door, and I did, and I went through the door, and I still... Right? It just... It's... Never done that before. That worked. Right, I tried to get him to do that, but... So I'm probably gonna lose some time here, but that's okay. That wasn't that bad. It was just really frustrating. But you know? But at least the door is open. I go to the main menu here to, to despawn all the enemies, which is what I would have done in the first place. And then I was able to pop off that heal and I would have been golden, but ah, oh man, I just got hit through the door, right? That's how close I was, man. I just picked up a heal gem and I would have, oh man, it was so close. This was a weird puzzle to figure out. Well, they're busy fighting. Forget what's in there. Yeah, I lost 24 seconds. I would have saved time for sure. Are these time saves? I'm just... Practice from last night, right? The practice from last night. Just, um... I got the stone boss, the giant boss figured out, and, you know, these... Yeah, it's going really nice. Nice. We, Chad and I found something last night. We, I forgot, dude. I did. I forgot until just now. Guys, check out this. Check out what Chad and I found. Oh man, I forgot until right now. We found something new. Yeah, I got that jump first try. But check this out. I swear to God, I swear to God, this is intended by the devs. So I have to run all the way around there, down there, and through there to get where I need to go. Check this out, guys. There I am, and then I skipped it all. Like, there's no way that that's not intended by the devs. That's so sick.
Dev door for sure. Oh, no way I dodged that, you fuck. This guy lets you attack him for so long, too. This guy's Probably just wait and use all the level up crystals. I can't imagine it's helping me that much with the level up. Right? Oh, we're not going to see the juicy time-saving key, too, because I forgot last run. Well, we know it's gold. <laughs> Still shiny. What? I want to try and do a dash glitch here. Uh, nothing. It, it is wonky there, though, that's for sure. So hopefully I do this the right way. If not, then I'm fucked. Whatever. She swung, but then warped. It's so weird. Okay, what? The same one, too? Oh. Dodging that was really good for me. Like, I'm not gonna yield. Nice, that's in the exact position that I need. Nice. Wow, good timing on that. Yeah, nice. Oh, she still hit me though. Damn it! I thought I, I thought I outsmarted her. No, I can't outsmart anyone today. Especially that guy who's better at biology than me.
Puzzle practice? You mean read off of a piece of paper? <laughs> yep, I'm about to get my puzzle practice on. Do the Chad strat. Right? I do the death warp for key two, and he does the warp for... Okay, what are we doing? Left, up, right, up, left, left. So, left, up, right, up, left, left, down, down, right, up, left, down, right, right, up, left, up, uh, up, right, shit, down, left, wait, down, left, down, right, up, I can't go left, what? Oh, I'm, I'm really close, okay, never mind. Oh, it's locked, man. That wasn't so bad. So the list is so long that I forget which, like, I forget what I'm looking at. I see, like, left, right, up, right, and then I look back at the sheet, and I'm like, wait, where, wait, which left and which right? Did the algorithm work? Essentially, yes. I just, I probably missed like an up or a left or I messed something up, that's all. Yeah, I read down and went left or something, yeah. Regardless, I messed it up. But that's okay. Like, the the lowest amount of possible moves to make that is 26 moves. I thought he was going to hit me there. Sure. hit me oh, some kind of backlash stab I guess please don't knock me off the ledge that would very much suck On, do something. Uh, 
that probably just saved it right there. Why aren't the crystals here the first time? I don't understand that. Stuff like that, that's just ridiculous. I don't even know what happened there for a sec. Almost got me there, that's crazy. Batman. Gosh. Come 
on, roll, roll, roll. Oh, oh my God, how did I survive that? What? Okay, he hit me and I still survived. Holy, I thought my big slice was gonna be... And I saved the heal, that's my, that's what I wanted. I wanted to save that heal. I can't believe he didn't kill me there. And that was so greedy, I should not have done that. I know the patterns. I was like, bloodlust. I should not have done that, but it worked. Imagine I glitched, like I couldn't... I'm gonna actually try something really quick here. <laughs> what? I couldn't go to the main menu? This thing, this tractor beam or whatever is so like strong. If I go to the main menu after it, I, that's gonna be so rage inducing. <laughs> what? It didn't let me go to the main menu? What is this game, dude? That's funny. He's having a bad time over there. I'm gonna wait, I'm not testing it. That was worth it. There's no way to spin them the opposite direction either. That's so fucking cheap. That's so fucking cheap. Both of my deaths today, both of my deaths were through a transition that I had no control over. Both of them. My only two deaths right here. Was taking damage and getting hit through door transitions or getting off ledges. So fucking unfair, man. Damn it. I understand I could have rolled away from that one where I actually died. But had I not taken the first one, I wouldn't have died there and I would have been able to pop my heal. Exact same thing as last time. God, it's just... It's so unfair for me. Yeah, I knew you were going through the wall. Nice try, buddy. I don't mean to bitch about it. It just sucks. Those are my two big mistakes. Our door transitions and fucking other things. Oh, stuck on a rock. What? Come on, dude. Wow. Arrowed. At least I, at least I don't have to worry about using heals here. As long as I have one for the boss, JIC, that should be okay. All right, what kind of pattern are these guys gonna be in? Oh, I didn't get hit. Okay, what are we dealing with here? What are we dealing? With? Very important. If you can make it, you might as well go. Nice, and it looks like I can dip to the left here. So this is looking good. Come on, guys. Come on. Right? 
it's just so unfair, man. I was stuck. God, man. I'm just done with my time losses being stuff like this, dude. God damn it. This is so bullshit. I was stuck and I died. I got off a transition and I died. I opened up a doorway and I died. Those were my three deaths this run. Oh my god. So unfucking fair. At least this isn't an eight hour run. That is something to take from that. This is why you always open the door first. I don't care anymore. I'm opening the door first. Even if I have a straight shot for the gas cans. Wait, why am I opening the door? Oh, I'm so noob. I just wasted even more time. Great. The whole run, like I'm opening the door for no reason. I don't know why I went back this way. Fuck me. This just takes me back to the beginning. It's just embedded in my brain to do this. I wasted even more time running back. I suck. I suck. Watch him chuck the gas can or her, sorry. Um, whatever, don't need that anymore. Oh, watch me get hit here too. Almost got hit. You can also get hit through the elevator too. Oh look, time save from the mail. Dude, he like orbited me. That was it. So my whole run in terms of etiquette is great, but if anyone watching this, when they get to the end, I'm gonna be yelling to fucking... Ah! ah that... Man, I wish I didn't have those deaths. This would've been great, dude. Shoot that elevator dragon. You missed the elevator, yeah. I just, I'm like not rolling the same. What are you doing? What is happening? I don't know what's happening. Why is my strategy... What is going on? Why is it doing this? I have this boss down pat. I don't understand why I was doing weird rolls. What? I don't know what's changed, man. What changed there? I didn't... I was unable to dodge all of them. Meanwhile, I can beat that boss without taking any damage. I don't understand what changed. Bad cause mad. You're worked up that change? Well, not really. Nice. Great, I'm stuck again. Oh, I'm stuck. Did that actually just happen again? I'm just trying to go through. The fact that you get stuck is fucked up. I was gonna get sub 120, but not anymore. It wasn't, it was my dodges. My dodges were weird, like my movement. Like I was in a bad position or like, Camera lock or something. Right? Now it's working great, right? It's my movement is different right now. See, I'm all worked up still, but nothing's changed. Now it's doing what it's supposed to do. Everything's working. Right? Look at this. I told you. 
Guys thought it was mad because dad. Like, no, like something's fucked with it when you first get here. It's messed up, dude. There's something weird. It was neither of those things. My movement was really weird. I think it had something to do with the way I came out of the elevator. Like, it fucked up the camera. All I know is it was weird. Secret staircase in the purple area. Well, I didn't rage at all during this run, so that's good. Not until the end, of course. But I have reason to. I'm gonna synchronize both those deaths and the boss, and I'm gonna prove that my movement was fucked up. And Chad can even attest to me that it's something that happens. It's very strange. Like my dodges weren't working. It was like I was locked or something. Very messed up. weird yeah I almost ran into that Pretty much just beat it without getting hit. One hit right at the end there, I got hit. That's it. I told you. I'm, I'm not crazy! Oh, so close! I lost I lost three and a half minutes at the end there. Mad cause rad. Well, I just annihilated it. But we get it. We did it. Okay, we got a much better time. We had a cringe end there. I know, I get it, but. We did it and we got great early game this time finally and we switched early game's great and then that late game a little a little mishmashy. Thank you very much THC. Welcome back for the 7 months. Is the world record unknown? The world record's unknown because live split is synchronized with speedruns.com and there's no game for it. This is world record for sure. Oh yeah. Until Chad beats it. And then and then I'll go back and try and take it back. Back and forth. First document. Well, no, this would be the second or third, right? Because I've already done it before. The 127 was. Sub one hour of the future. Take off another 20 minutes. Unless Chad doesn't his record in OBS. That's true. He doesn't record and he gets runs all the time. <laughs> I told Kaylee about that, Chad, and she's like, Come on, Chad. I mean, you're already there. You just record. <laughs> She's like, why wouldn't he? Oh, you recorded today? How did it go? Chad's like, uh, I have a 119. 
That sounds like something that would happen. He's like, yeah, I got a 118. 